She's so effing late, you guys. So what? Effing late. I'm so late because this one, seven o'clock, I'm supposed to be there at dinner. Why do you blame it on the Mexican? If Y-E-S spells yes, what does E-Y-E-S spell? E-Y? Yes. If Y-E-S spells yes, what uh -huh. does E-Y-E-S spell? Oh my god, why can I not process that? <laughs> so, what is it? E-Y-E-S? If Y-E-S spells yes, uh -huh. what does E-Y-E-S spell? Ice? Yes! My friend is so smart! <laughs> Bitch got it. Why? She got it. Are you tricking me? It's a trick question. Some people say like I did. What do you say, friend? Yes. You did not. I watch too much world star hip hop. What is heavier? One pound of rocks or one pound of cotton? One pound of rocks or one pound of cotton? Mm -hmm. I mean, I, did, I mean, I would just say at the top of my head it will be the rocks. But I guess it's a tricky question, so I will have to say the cotton. <laughs> <laughs> Think about it. It's not a trick question. It's a simple I question. Feel like you're testing me. No, 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 no. This is a simple one. If one, what is heavier, one pound of rocks or one pound of cotton? I want to say the cotton. I don't know why. Okay. You what? ready for the answer? Yeah. They're both a pound. Really? Yeah. A pound of rocks and a pound of cotton. How does that even happen? You just get a lot, a lot, a lot of cotton and maybe one rock. Very question. So now it's my turn to ask you questions. Okay, what? I'm gonna ask you questions that people want that people ask me to ask you that they might want to know about you. <laughs> They're so random and weird because she's like so humble. She really is humble. When I say she, it's her, not me, because Aww. she knows who she is. We call she to each other. Yeah, I know but people I mean, are like, like why is she? She number she? one over here. Aww. The real she. If you guys know what I mean. <laughs> First thing that, that you do when you get up. Like, Dulce just opened her eyes. First thing? Yeah. Obviously your man is next to you. Yeah. And maybe your little one is next to you too. Oh, what is the first thing I put on my clothes? Put on my shorts and... Yeah, put on my PJs so I can go downstairs. Okay. What about you? Um... I immediately grab my cell phone. Really? Yeah. What do you check? What network? I go straight to IG. Oh, okay. She's coming up. She's coming up, <laughs> you guys. She's coming up. I'm coming up. All right. She's like, why do I look so little? Yes. Oh my God. Ooh. Hey. Oh, okay, okay. All right, so what? Is that better? Yes, that's better. So what would you say it's the weirdest thing that you eat for other people that other people are going to be like, what? So for me, I'm Mexican. That goes to tripa, which is like intestines, I guess. Yes. And people want to yes. gag by the, by the time I say that. Yeah. What would you say? Um, I would have to say menudo, which is, isn't it kind of like the same thing? The guts, the lining of a goat or something? The lining of a, I don't know if it's a goat or, or it's a, a, cow. a cow. I want to say something it's a cow. Like that. So menudo is basically that. I had a boyfriend in the army and he was black. And the only reason I'm saying that is because he's like, we don't eat this in my culture. He's like, because I took him to a Mexican restaurant. He was so disgusted by it. I was like, this is bomb. I don't know what you're talking about. I was that is it. so weird. Yeah. The next question is, when you look at yourself in the mirror, what is one thing that you always look at? For me, I always look at my lips. Like, <laughs> you you would. You I don't would. know why. <laughs> I always look at my lips. I love my lips. I love my eyes. You always look at your eyes, yeah, you go straight into your yeah. eyes like, oh, okay. I, have I do actually, lash. I do. Today they look, they look better, they have better lashes yeah. and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, they're just like, I love what, how they look without makeup. Because she's been MIA for the past month. Yeah, everybody's asking me about the cliffhanger at the end. You know, about my passion, but I'm not going to reveal my passion. Why? Because, you know what, if people are not in your same frequency, they're going to bash it. I think I just want to show them my passion. I think that's better. Yeah? I think that's better. Okay, what inspires Dulce? What inspires me? Ooh. Sometimes she doesn't even know, like, I'm always telling her, like, Dulce, you have done, accomplished so much, like, honestly, guys, like, she has accomplished <laughs> so much, and I'm like, that she doesn't even, like, realize it, but because she's very humble, thank God, and she's not, like, so Hollywood fake, which otherwise she would not be my friend. Yeah, my family, definitely. 
What inspires but, me is but the. But do your family inspires you or motivate you? Oh, to, they motivate me. Because I was motivate. gonna say my niece and my nephew, but, but actually they will motivate me because they're my little ones. I have two, and a niece and a nephew. Yeah, and they're like they're my so we're all there. Like my you everything. have a little mini you. I have a little mini picture. Me. Jorge, <laughs> mini version, so yeah. cute. And he's like all over the place, like yeah, me. but. They are actually my motivation. They're like my two worlds. So I always think like, oh, I'm gonna do everything for them. Yeah. So what inspires you? Okay. So, so, they, my so family? our family will be our motivation. Okay. So but we're on the it, same page. Okay. But what motivates you? What motive? No. When no. you're like, fuck, I'm bored. Like, I don't need. I can't do. I can't do any more lipsticks. I can't do any more blushes. I can't do any more fucking foundations. Where <gasps> that effort am I gonna get inspiration from? Nature is what inspires me. What about nature? Like you want to go to the desert or like you want to go to like You want to go to like where I want to go to Costa Rica again uh, But honestly like here living at home as long as I'm out in the mountains or by the ocean. Okay It rejuvenates me. It's like my friend Sonia said that nature is God's way of romancing you and you I actually like to be around nature like it really it, when I say nature Copion. I mean like forest especially Copion. She's saying couple color. <laughs> but no, I think I like to be in the tropical, like in the jungle. Like like being oh. nosy and like yeah. getting and hearing the, the, the birds and like sweating your ass off yeah. and being all stinky yeah. and like don't you have flawless skin because everything's so yes. humid and dewy yes. as this bitch. I think is. you need a I think you need a trip. I, I to think like so too. like Central America, somewhere I really do. I recommend Costa Rica. I would love to go to Cuba, but like Costa Rica would do. That is your spot. With that's all. Tittle do. <laughs>